Tidy up. Ashling is playing in her room. She has taken all the toys out. Ashling, don't take everything out. Put the toys back before you take new ones out. But I can't, Mommy. My teddy bear wants to play with everything. Don't make excuses, Ashling. Tidy up your room, or you can't find your toys later. Sean has caught a cold. His room is in a mess too. Sean, put the dirty tissues into the bin. It is very unhygienic if you throw used tissues all over the floor. I can't mummy. I'm having a runny nose. I know. But the bin is right beside you. Your dirty tissues are everywhere now. You can't even see the things on the floor. Grace is doing her project on her bed. She is also making a mess. Grace, look at your room. Why don't you do your project at your desk? I cannot, mummy. I concentrate better on my bed. Come on, Grace. You can sit at your desk and still concentrate. Please be careful. Don't step on the paint, or you will ruin your project. After a while. Mommy, where is my dummy? It should be in your room, but your room is too messy. I want it now! Well, you need to tidy up your room to find it. No, I won't. Ashling, you have messed it up. So you have to tidy up, or no dummy for you. No, I won't. Well, I guess no dummy for you, then. Fine! Suddenly, a loud scream comes from Sean's room. Sean, are you alright? I stepped on my robot. It's broken. I told you to clean up the floor. Give the robot to me and see if I can fix it. Thanks, mommy. I'll tidy up now. When Mummy is fixing Sean's robot, Grace screams in her room. Grace, what happened? I stepped on the paint. My project is ruined. I told you to do it on the desk. Let's tidy up now. I will help you with the project later. Thank you, Mummy. I will listen to you from now on. Good girl.